Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Soul Eater episode number 45. Okay, um, previous episode, um, Rona and Mari went into Medusa's lair and confronted uh, Medusa and decided like they thought they would take Stein back and uh, Krona would uh, stand up to Medusa of like his own will and everything like his own conviction but unfortunately it turns out it was a bit too early because obviously Medusa had the upper hand uh, Krona was unable to like uh, stand against Medusa the shackles from his past kind of like uh, hindered him and uh turns out stein is kind of under like the control of his madness and not under marusa's control but under the control of the madness in itself because he can understand that it like mari is there but he is unable to process the whole thing that mari is alive because in his mind in his the hallucinations that he saw he saw that mari was dead and everything like weird kind of things that he saw so he is unable to like uh, distinguish between the fantasy and the reality. Everything's messed up in his head, and yeah, like that's basically it. So that was the previous episode, and they were not ready to confront them, and they kind of got into a pinch. But thankfully, Marka came in. Marka and Soul came in, and she is now going to provide backup for them. So yeah guys, um, without further ado, let's get started with episode number 45 of Soul Eater. Oh, also before I start, uh, as I've said before in the previous uh, episode as well, I'm doing a poll to replace, uh, like for the anime that is going to replace Soul Eater, is in the comment section below. Uh, go to the link and you can vote for it. And uh, I will only take the votes into consideration if 10 or more votes are like done. Uh, otherwise, I would like choose from one of uh, like one of the animals that I prefer and I would do it So yeah, anyways, I'll do one of the animals from it. So that is in stone set in stone Yeah, anyways guys, uh, so without further ado, let's get started All right, so I'll bring the subtitles and the timer here Think it to whichever is your preference and let's get started All right, so here's the countdown three two one Go. Hmm. Ready? Ah. But unfortunately, you were not ready for this. Yeah. Oh. Okay, <laughs> let's go. Okay, we're starting with the opening. Ah, well, let's see. Like, uh, Arachne is kind of the bad, uh, like, character in, like, the evil character in the later, like, part of the show. That is the last half of the show. But we barely got to see her. Like, she is just basically, like, the, I don't know, queen, like, sitting in her throne and <laughs> just sipping some wine and, <laughs> like, ordering people. So, yeah, like, that was... Like the extent, uh, uh, we saw, I think, um, like, yeah, Medusa is kind of like the 
bad guy from the beginning of the series like from the beginning to the end she has remained and yeah she is still here so <laughs> she's kind of like the i don't know like the main antagonist of the whole series <laughs> yeah because like i thought maybe we would go to get to see more arachne or kishin but turns out it's just medusa it always has been <laughs> Okay, let's see. Okay. Uh <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's see. Uh now Oh boy, yeah, that's also another thing. Yeah, but Maka doesn't care, I think. Yeah, she doesn't care. Well, Medusa, you're in a pinch now. Yep. Like she was emotionally manipulating them, but like Maka doesn't give a damn. Yeah, okay. Like beat her up until she messes up. That's the plan. <laughs> um, nobody cares about the plan. <laughs> Demon hunt. Hmm. Yeah, and Stein's also there. Oh, will you like get? Oh, okay. And there he is. I was thinking when he's going to like come out. Okay. Yep, they have the number and each and every like three of them are quite strong. And the combined soul resonance with soul playing the piano. <laughs> okay. But Stein is here. Like that's the problem. He is like in his own world in his mind. Come on. Okay. I'm thinking like they could have done one thing like Mari could have gone for Medusa and Krona for Stein that would have like like did not make them hesitate so much okay Oh my god. <laughs> and there is another noisy guy. <laughs> Baba Yaga. Ooh. What is that? Oh, those are traps. Mm. 
Okay. Oh. Oh my god. Um guys, look behind you. <laughs> well, he is the strongest, so Oh no. Uh. Oh, okay. Well, she is. Um, will that work? I doubt. Okay. Apparently, I got the wrong person. Oh. Oh no. Uh, I th I think Corona hardened his blood. Uh, he'll probably be fine. I think so. I hope so. Or not. I'm hearing some dripping sound. Oh. Oh no. Wait. Wait, is this really happening? What the hell? Wait, what the hell? I'm surprised, like, I did not expect this. What the? That was like abrupt and suddenly. Wait, what? Yes, I I don't know what to. Oh. Oh no! Yeah, yeah. The the whole thing will like. Oh my God! The imp. Oh God! It's... Oh no, he is, she is like, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Okay, are you here? Oh, she's using her own power.
I stopped. Her eye, you, see, you like always wear a word and eye patch in that eye. Okay, Maka also kind of like got. Yeah. Yeah, he she also snapped out of it. Okay. <laughs> okay, you have work to do, Stein. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh yeah, she, like she, he can wield her now. Okay, let's. All right. But what about Ragnarok? <laughs> Let's see if she has any more tricks up her sleeves. Ah, who gives a sh damn? Oh, ho -ho. Uh, they can knock you out. The like that's also an option. Like they they don't need to kill you, they can knock you out and take custody of you. Okay, tables have turned. Oh yeah. Okay, she can also like Oh, uh, the demon wavelength, yeah. Demon hunter, yeah. And the demon wavelength. Okay, yeah. Yeah, the, 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 like the bad thing in her will go away. Well, that coincidence has to like repeat again. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um Ooh. Come on. Oh my god. Oh, he she got her. 
Okay. She's kind of in a like transparent form. What? Wait, what? Oh. Oh. Yeah, I kind of figured that out. What? Um, what about Ragnarok? Oh. Um. Oh, what? Oh. Okay, well. Yeah, and Maka needs to go, uh, like, support the others, I think. Yeah. Okay. Well, all responsibility on her, that means. Um. Nani? <laughs> Um, uh, I think that's Black Star. Haha, <laughs> because that's Black Star. <laughs> and Mifune. Oh boy. <laughs> but yeah, Mifune is here. Yeah, your rival from the second episode. <laughs> okay, well, um, I kind of expected this because they have a lot of things to cover, so I knew they were going to wrap this whole Medusa thing up. In one or two episodes and turns out they did they really did it and they uh, like wrapped it out in this episode okay um, but I was kind of like uh, I don't know it really surprised that uh, when like Krona kind of got stabbed and um, I thought like I had this kind of feeling that they would probably not kill him off but when I don't know at that moment I kind of thought did they really kill him off or something but uh like after stein woke up and she he said something about like i can feel his uh, soul strength i thought that like, yeah like they did not kill him but i am not so sure about ragnarok like what happened to him i'm not sure about that so yeah like that's one thing anyways uh but like like ragnarok is kind of like i don't know mixed in with Krona's blood so who knows maybe if Krona like 
it covers like Ragnarok might come back I don't know like I'm not sure about that we'll see probably okay up uh, that's the end of episode number 45 all right so this episode was more or less a uh, mark of fighting um medusa and looking at this episode i think this is probably like really the end of medusa like there are, have been a lot of instances where i've seen uh, medusa like well like medusa died and he she like again come back came back after like five or six episodes but i think most probably this is her end and one thing i'm mm, like not sure is that i think i've heard somewhere that uh the ending episodes of soul eater deviates from the manga i'm not sure from which episode it deviates but i think like on uh, the like story that we're seeing here is anime original isn't it like uh i think i've like i've seen it somewhere where they explained that the reason why they did this was uh, the same reason that Full Metal Alchemist kind of went on a like similar path, like anime original, because it like caught up to the manga. I think a similar thing was with uh, Soul Eater. So they kind of made an, made this, like orig anime original episodes to like continue the uh, like anime, uh, so just like uh, Full Metal Alchemist. But in Full Metal Alchemist, it was like they later on did another anime, which was Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, which followed the manga completely. And it was a goddamn masterpiece. And I'm not sure, uh, like, so they never, I, I don't think, like, they have any plan of doing Soul Eater again, but, uh, like, they did not do, I think, the original, um, like, they did not go to, like, uh, the original manga's plot and did the anime original episodes, and they, like, did not uh, make a new anime which completely followed the manga, just like Full Metal Alchemist did. So, I'm not sure i i might be wrong but i think uh it was something like that like these episodes that like we are seeing are original like anime original episodes there were none, none of these were in the mangas um i don't know uh like a lot of uh, things uh, we have seen the like medusa dying and everything uh i'm not sure if that actually happened in the manga so who knows i'll probably check it out later on uh. But yeah, for this episode, uh, it is like Medusa's end. And I doubt she's going to come back because this is the 45th episode, uh, which is almost at the end. Uh, we are uh, f at the 45th episode and this anime has 51 episodes. So it's almost at the end. So I doubt Medusa is going to come back. Uh, most probably in the next few episodes, we're going to like uh, deal with Mifune, um, uh, the chainsaw guy, uh, or uh, who else? Uh, mosquito if he comes and starts fighting again then <clears throat> i'm not sure what will happen to elka and free like what are they going to do and the uh, uh mice uh which is uh the name was izune or something like that i can't remember anyways yeah and um arachne and kishin finally i think um so yeah and the whole thing with avon there is another like the mystery that is like hovering around <laughs> So who knows if they will like shed some light to that matter as well. So yeah, and <laughs> excuse me, and uh, Stan is back. Well, that is good news. And one thing I was thinking, like mm, none of this <laughs> like problem would have happened if uh, like they like like Madi and Krona came in the like Medusa's hideout and decided to like take back stein and krona decided to confront medusa but if they like reversed it like uh if um, mari went for medusa like went to fight medusa and krona went to fight stein i think their like uh i don't know their own emotions would have been kept under check and they would have been able to perform a lot better but unfortunately uh like medusa uh, like krona had to stand up to medusa himself like that was a necessity so that is something that obviously they were not able to do so chrono go had to went go and face medusa unfortunately he was not ready and medusa still had a kind of a hold on him so he like got defeated and mark had to like jump in and save him 
and same with uh, Mari. She like was unable to like unleash her full power uh, against Stein because number one, she is a death sight. Like someone wields her, that is that would like increase her power. And even though she is able to wield herself, that is still not like her full power is not being used at that. And she's more like as we saw, she's more like a kind of a uh, um, buffer. Like she kind of purifies the wavelengths and all, and uh, she, which she used to like <clears throat> make Stein uh, come to his senses. So yeah, and obviously Stein is the best like uh, master in Shibusen. So all of these were the reason why Mari was also now able to stand up to Stein. But um. Yeah, they kind of like he she took the chance of Maka fighting with them and swooped in and purified uh, Stein's way, uh, soul wavelength or whatever, and he got back to his senses. And Stein coming back to his senses means yeah, yeah, it's all over. Like Medusa has like become alone. She herself would definitely not be able to like stop all of these things that are happening. Uh, like Stein and uh, Maka, they are like both are using soul resonances. How can you like stop them like that in that condition? And we've already known that uh, Medusa is a lot weakened because she is using uh, a little girl's body. So yeah, she cannot use her full uh, strength. So yeah, it was game over the moment uh, Stein came back. And I was a bit concerned about the whole thing with Krona. I was not sure what actually they were trying to do. Because I was under the impression that, excuse me, I was under the impression that they would probably not do anything to Krona because, uh, like, he is kind of like one of the main characters of this show. So, like, suddenly, abruptly killing him like that would not be something that they do, especially at the end of the, like, almost at the end of the show. But, uh, still, I was a little bit of, um, like, concerned when, like, Ragnarok died like that was uh, not died. I'm not sure what happened to Ragnarok, but it kind of seemed as if he died But anyways, I was a little bit concerned at that time like even before that I thought that no, maybe he, he will be okay but when Ragnarok kind of like faded in like faded out and Like Krona closed his eyes I was thinking like did they really kill him off like Ragnarok dying was like more like uh, Like something in his blood dying so I thought maybe that like really he was going to be killed off this episode and I was really not sure what they were trying to do and was this really like how it goes I was thinking like is this really how it goes um, but like uh, Stan came back and he said that nah he's fine we can like I can still hear his wavelength soul wavelength so I'll promise that I will bring him back so focus on your like battle now Maka so yeah and um, Maha kind of got, went out of control and I'm still not sure about one thing um, that is like it seemed as if the demon is within soul when like when we saw the little imp thing for the first time uh, like it, it like yeah the demon is within soul so like I've or, like I've noticed this in the like earlier as well. Like, Paul usually does not lose his control, lose his cool. He is always like calm and everything, and he does not let the demon take over. But usually it is Maka. Like in one of the previous episodes when like they had a fight with Krona, um, when they like tapped into that like soul resonance thing and everything, Maka kind of went like crazy at that time. Which uh, like thankfully he like. Uh, like she was able to keep, come back uh, to normal. That and this episode, um, where again we see Maka losing control and um, like those kind of like things were like dripping inside his like soul's uh, inner space, and the demon was all happier and thinking that yeah I will be able to <laughs> cause mayhem now and I will be like free something like that I'll be able to like destroy stuff. So it was very happy at that. Um, so yeah, and this was also the, like the second time Maka kind of lo lost control. So I'm not sure about this thing because like it seems as if like Maka is the one who is like uh, fueling the demon. 
with uh, her like anger and everything her emotional state which i thought maybe it was like soul who was supposed to do that the soul usually keeps his calm every time and <clears throat> he usually tries to calm marka down as well and like snap her out of the whole thing but like i already like we already knew that marka has kind of a special thing within her because uh, there was one time that i still remember that not one time like two times uh, or more times we saw like first was like when medusa uh, injected uh, not injected uh, kind of like uh, let that black blood within get within um soul that was the time when uh, like the when they did the soul resonance thingy uh, it also kind of went into marka and like mark was coughing up blood and everything and uh, like medusa thought that yeah maybe she is also going to get like infected and everything and but like she like we even saw like medusa herself being surprised saying that uh, why did it not work with her what actually happened but i think uh, i'm not sure like there was some kind i can't remember that episode there was something like some kind of thing that stein did at that time as well so it was i think the uh, that was also another consequence of like marka keeping her uh, like cool and everything like i think stein kind of swapped some swiped something at that time i can't remember that episode something happened anyways that and also in another episode we saw um like that demon kind of also say that i cannot like like i don't know like i cannot get inside marka or something like that so like she has something within her which i think is supposed to be that anti demon whatever that they are talking about a uh, wavelength uh, which she like inherited from her mom and that is called anti demon so why does his her anger like her emotion will sub the demon like it's kind of i don't know like like opposite both of them are opposite so how does that happen uh but still anyways uh, i think uh, that anti demon thing is which usually like uh, like saves marka but her anger her emotion when like she is bound with soul with that soul resonance thing uh, when she becomes like unstable and emotionally uncontrollable uh, it kind of affects soul as well and so <clears throat> that in turn affects the whole like demon and the demon becomes happy and everything and uh, yeah they usually lose control at that moment so yeah anyways i'm not going to like uh, think too much to this because obviously uh, this is something that i think they probably explain later on the manga i'm not sure because our enemies almost at the end i doubt they are going to explain anything about marka's mom or the whole anti demon thing that she has within herself and everything uh, they are i think they are like probably just brushing it and like uh, like touching the tip of it without going into the depth because obviously this is an anime it has like limited number of episodes unlike a manga yeah <laughs> anyways so yeah that was this episode and in the end we'll see a uh, black star <laughs> going for baba yaga's castle and running into mifune so in the next episode i'm guessing they we would probably see uh, black star versus mifune which i also think would be wrapped up in one episode because uh, there are a lot of things left the whole kishin business and arachne business so yeah so i think like they won't uh, spend much time on this as well so anyways guys so yeah guys um that was this episode this was episode number 45 of soul eater so if you guys enjoyed my reaction press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed excuse me and comment down below anything you want to say about this episode or anything in general be sure to comment down i'll check them out and so yeah and also um i'm as i said uh, in the beginning of the episode uh, i'm doing a poll it's in the comment section below uh, the link to it you can go there and vote for the anime that i would probably react to after soul eater ends replacing this so feel free to go and vote for the anime that you want and i'll do uh, like the majority of the vote i'll only take into consideration if 10 or more votes are like reached otherwise i will check uh, like choose one of the animes from my personal choice and do it and uh, like just take a note i uh, like i have a plan of doing each and every anime that is on the poll uh, uh, gradually 
because uh, like they are like one of the most iconic shows for example haiku um uh, ruby and what else Av avatar and what else did i give code gears all of these these are like a few of the most popular shows evangelion so which i have not watched unfortunately even though i've like watched so many animes so uh like i've kept this and i'm planning on reacting to them because these are kind of like the only old shows that i still have not watched so yeah like it will be a proper blind reaction to them. so anyways i plan on doing them each and every one of them but uh it will take time so yeah anyways guys so thank you guys for watching so i'll see you guys in the next video which will like next soul eater video which will be after one day so until then goodbye and have a nice day